I'm super proud of how far our society has come. Like I even just look at my peers, right? Like Dustin Poirier just did this amazing interview on Ariel and this is a man who literally gets in a cage and fights oh my God. for a living, you know. He's a savage. He's, he's Dude. he is like We were talking about it on the way over here. You no, know, he's I, a beast. I wanted to ask you just real quick cuz you brought him up. How electrifying was UFC 299 just oh, recently yeah. it when was he awesome. knocked him out? Yeah. How loud did that place get? No, it was crazy. Is that? I mean, it's. I've watched that video magic so many times. It's online. magic. It's why we do what we do. I love him for that feeling of magic. And they know? like talked him down, like, oh, you know, he's. This is a huge fight. Like mm-hmm. this dude's a new upcoming. He's a savage, and then mm-hmm. he just went in there and got shit done I know. quick. I know. It was unbelievable. Yeah, I know. But he, to me, like, yes, Dustin's performance is amazing, and like he. That's why. That's why people love him. But for me, why I love him even more is what he did, whatever, Monday after the fight when he was like, no, dude, like, I wasn't okay. I was in a really bad place after I lost. Like, Mm -hmm. I was questioning who I am. And, like, his willingness to be open as a man, I think, as a fighter, Mm -hmm. as this, like, larger-than-life killer. Dude, he is a man's man. yeah. And men's men have feelings too. And it's okay to not be okay. Yeah. And like, <laughs> yeah, dude, it, I mean, I just have so much more, I have more respect for that than for the performance. Mm-hmm. Like to me, that is why he is a, a winner in life. Mm-hmm. You know, when Ariel said it really hit home for, or at least that respect. Mm-hmm. I mean, I, I respect him as a fighter, of course. Mm-hmm. And then him, you know, being vulnerable mm-hmm. in an interview like that, when Ariel asked him, he said, well, was it just in the cage? Or, meaning, are you, you know, were you thinking about retirement? Mm-hmm. And then he said, or was it outside of the cage? And he said it was outside of the cage, yeah. alluding to something way more serious. Yeah. And for him yeah. to say, you know how many people he probably helped just right. by putting no, himself out That's there? What and how I many mean. people look up right. to him? Mm-hmm. And for him to, exactly. To Get him on the podcast. Mm-hmm. <laughs> if you're listening Dustin. <laughs> no for him to just say like i wasn't okay like that's yeah. such a powerful surrender yeah mm-hmm. it is it's a beautiful thing it, it is. is a beautiful thing and when you go through it it's such a humbling process mm-hmm. and um it changes you and that fear mm-hmm behind anything mm-hmm. it starts to go away little starts by to subside, little yeah and it, it doesn't paralyze you as much mm-hmm. in certain situations totally i recently i quit a job at google um i mean look there were other you know there were some reasons why but you know just to not have a job and just do a podcast weekly <laughs> i mean 10 yeah. years ago my anxiety would Big be risk. through the roof mm-hmm. and i you know so um yeah, it's just that means you're probably in the right place. Oh, of course, I know, know I'm in the right place. Absolutely, yeah. and it's it's but it's but that's it's the, the beautiful work. thing about it. Yeah, is you did the work and you're still doing the work, still every doing day. the work, and you're but you're also accepting of like you're doing something different. You're not doing what you always did to get the results you always got to like run the race you always ran. You're doing something different, and different can be scary, but different is also like. That's where, like, life happens, you know, real life, like living, experiencing life the way it is meant to be. And when you live in your purpose, when you find your purpose and then you actively take the step of obedience to live in it, like, the game changes, you yeah. know? You, that, that peace that you have, that, like, the anxiety disappearing, like, that's... Because you're you're doing the next right thing. Yeah. You just 